from South Central, so you open your door and you look to the left and the right. I'm just playing. Now come on in. In real life, Fast and the Furious star Tyrese Gibson is more of a house guy than a car guy. After all, he does have a jaw dropping 6 story, 25,000 square foot mansion in Atlanta, Georgia to call home, so I can definitely see why. He recently showed off his dream house to Architectural Digest and it's complete with two 16 foot tall transformers and features like an isolated swimming pool and garden. Not to mention, he formerly owned another villa style estate in Woodland Hills, California, and today we'll take a look at Tyrese's properties. In these videos, we don't reveal any addresses, and even though I've done a house tour of my own place, please do not show up at any private residences because it's not safe for anyone. Tyrese Gibson is a singer, rapper, actor, model, and more who started off releasing several albums back in the day and then transitioned into film. The actor added lead roles in plenty of Hollywood blockbusters like Four Brothers, playing Roman Pierce in the Fast and the Furious franchise, and of course, starring in the Transformers film series. Why else do you think Tyrese has life size Transformers? inside his mansion. At the time of this recording, the actor has amassed himself a net worth of $6 million or more, but his Atlanta home alone is quite the investment, and he definitely has a palace worthy of bragging rights. Hey everyone, I'm Kara the Vampire Slayer, and I'm bringing you another exclusive house tour here on Famous Entertainment, this time showing you the luxury properties of Tyrese Gibson. If you haven't already, make sure you subscribe and ring that bell for notifications, because we post brand new content daily. As always, you can follow me on Instagram and let me know who you want me to feature next on here. Now let's get into this video. Recently, in May 2021, Tyrese listed his estate in Woodland Hills, California up for sale, which at the time had one of his Transformer statues posted up in the yard. According to listing materials, the life-size Bumblebee replica could be purchased along with the home, but it seems like Tyrese ended up taking it to his Atlanta mansion with him. According to reports, the actor purchased this villa about a decade ago in 2011 for just over $1 million, and more recently is selling it for $3.5 $5 million. This home is Mediterranean in style, situated on about half an acre of land in the Walnut Acres neighborhood of Woodland Hills, California. This area is close to Tarzana and borders the Santa Monica Mountains in the San Fernando Valley region of LA. Inside, Tyrese's former abode boasted 5,225 square feet of space with five bedrooms, six bathrooms, and airy ceilings throughout. The interiors were also slightly traditional in style with tan and neutral tones wrought iron accents, and tile and hardwood flooring. The gorgeous foyer had 26 foot ceilings, a glimmering chandelier, and winding stairs. The kitchen here was massive, but still inviting and warm, with a couple of bar style seats at the center island and another dining table in the corner. There was more than one cozy living room with plush couches, both of which also had flat screen TVs and fireplaces. And if those don't do it for movie night, I think the best room in Tyrese's former home was definitely the screening room. The home theater, both Boasted a classic vibe with vaulted ceilings, surround sound, and a large projector screen. As for Tyrese's former master suite, it featured dual walk in closets, a fireplace, and his attached bath had both a steam shower and separate soaking tub. Elsewhere in the spacious pad, there was even a home gym. During his time living here, Tyrese completely customized the backyard, installing a street sign marked with Voltron Enterprises Parkway, the name of his limited liability company. Not to mention, he added a neon sign of the company's logo back there and the Bumblebee replica which anchored the space. The Transformer was so tall it almost cleared the terrace on the second floor, which you could reach via an iron spiral staircase. Of course, Bumblebee was a fan favorite from the first Transformers film in 2007, which Tyrese was in. The gorgeous backyard also had a large patio, manicured lawns, and of course, a swimming pool and hot tub. While Tyrese's former Woodland Hills home was impressive, it's got nothing on his current Atlanta mansion, which boasts six sprawling stories and his most definitely dream home goals. The actor recently opened up his doors for Architectural Digest to show off his lavish property, located in the exclusive Buckhead neighborhood of Atlanta, Georgia. Inside, the house spans 25,000 square feet and boasts seven bedrooms and nine and a half baths throughout. Tyrese purchased the mega mansion around 2018, it seems, and it's 
built in a beautiful French chateau style with a tasteful royal feel, and still manages to be welcoming. Despite the thrones, shag carpets, and custom everything, Tyrese made sure his abode was open to friends and guests who could comfortably lounge in a leather chair and kick back and relax. The actor said about his home, I wanted guests to feel the regal energy, the regal vibe, but it's very livable. No one comes into my house and I'm like, I'm sorry, you can't sit here. Pulling up to Tyrese's home, it already wows with the exterior, and we can see he brought his custom street sign along with him here. The marble entryway has double height ceilings, frame moldings, and a fancy staircase, which all came like this when Therese purchased the home. And if you prefer, there's an elevator to access all six levels. Of course, he added his life-size bumblebee transformer here in the entryway, and I think it's an even better fit than at the backyard at his old place. What do you guys think? Elsewhere, Tyrese also has the Optimus Prime, and they are about 16 feet tall each. In the future, he plans to use them for what will be Voltron Studios Hollywood, a full-service film studio he's creating in Atlanta. His main living room features a roaring fireplace, and Tyrese has said this is where guests go to feel zen. Moving to Tyrese's kitchen, the space boasts three islands, an endless fridge space for veggies, fruit, meat, or whatever else his chef plans to prepare. A breakfast room sits right off the kitchen, and Tyrese uses this space on the daily. It's decked out with a chandelier and custom curtains, which came with the home, but his designer fit it with the current furnishings. In the much less casual dining room, this space was designed with a Middle Eastern inspiration and also boasts shag carpet, a fireplace, and throne-like chairs at either end of the table. Prior to Tyrese moving in, his Atlanta mansion had gone through a number of owners, all of which the actor gives thanks to for putting the work into the home. He didn't change much, but he did want to customize the place to be his dream home, and Tyrese hired Sue Wishingrad, an LA-based designer, to see his vision through. Next up in his Victorian style, abode is his high-end office, which is designed in a mostly black color scheme, making it a lot different than the other spaces in the home. Tyrese calls his home office a shark tank, and it also features an inviting fireplace, street signs with inspirational names, and walls covered in custom mirrors. I can definitely see why a space like this would easily get any creative juices flowing. Moving to Tyrese's bedroom, which he titled The Love Nest, it's actually password protected because it's on the main floor of the mansion, just to make sure it stays private. The master retreat boasts a sitting area with large sunny window and chandelier overhead, a fireplace as well as his bed with a large plush headboard. Not to mention nearly everything in this room is custom. The luxury vibes are made complete with a ton of pillars and beams, while the ensuite bath is made of marble and glass, even featuring marble curtains. Just when you thought that was it, Tyrese's basement level is a whole nother world as he likes to call it. Here there's a fully stacked home gym and spaces like a game room with poker table and more. If any friends are staying over, the basement also boasts a full guest suite that looks more comfortable than most hotels. We can't miss his recording studio either. This room is full of all the equipment you need to record an album, and Tyrese says if he has guests in the music business, this is where he hangs out with them. Some of the goodies here include a 24K gold microphone, and next door, there's a full conference room to hold important meetings. One floor up from here, which is the top level of the mansion, there's an impressive home theater with projection screen. And this isn't the only option to watch movies either. We haven't even covered the two acres of beautiful grounds that surround Tyrese's mansion, and back here there's another outdoor movie setup. This may just be my favorite feature of his home, even though it's hard to choose, and his amazing outdoor theater has a massive screen as well as a covered nook to sit in if it's raining. Not to mention, there are countless other seating options on the lawn. Other features in Tyrese's sprawling yard include a completely isolated garden, a covered patio, trampoline for his kids, and of course a swimming pool and spa. The actor's not so humble abode is enough to make anyone envious, but he knows how lucky he is to live here. He said about his Atlanta dream home. As I pull up to my house every day, I am literally in disbelief that it's mine. People come over and they don't want to leave. This place has been a gift that keeps on giving and I will never, ever let it go. So now we've taken a deep dive into two of Tyrese Gibson's homes, so I think that concludes this house tour. We saw his former Woodland Hills villa style abode and his current Atlanta dream mansion that features six floors no less. And what did you guys think? Now the first house was gorgeous, but it's got nothing on his current mansion. Not only is his Georgia home a mass of 25,000 square feet, it literally has every amenity, from a swimming pool, to a gym, to a recording studio, and even two choices for a home theater. Of course, Tyrese also has his extra special transformers on display just to complete the setup. 
I said it before, but I'll say it again. My favorite part of this property was that outdoor theater. I've never seen one with such a perfect setup like that. Let me know down in the comments if you guys preferred his indoor or outdoor movie theater best, or what your favorite room in his house was. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to follow me on Instagram, and I will see you all in the next video. Bye.